Microfiber cloths are amazing for cleaning tons of stuff around a home, but they are not a one size fits all solution, no. Paper towels do still serve an important purpose in the home. And we often get asked, when does it make sense to use microfiber cloths versus paper towel? So in this video, we're gonna clear up that confusion. We're gonna give you some very definitive answers so you know the difference between a stain or a spill that you should be using microfiber on versus a stain or a spill that you should be using paper towel on. Now the pro of paper towel, it's readily accessible. It is one and done. You use it and get rid of it. You never have to think about it again. No matter what you wipe up with it, it is out of sight, out of mind. The cons of paper towel, the costs add up over time. There's obviously an environmental impact for using tons and tons of paper product. And also it kind of creates this bad habit where you can just reach for a paper towel. Oh, I'll just clean that with a paper towel, just wipe this with a paper towel, I'll blot that. It really is habit forming. For microfiber cloths, the pros are plentiful, starting off with the fact that they are reusable. The average microfiber cloth can be reused around 500 times. They're super, super absorbent. They come in a multitude of different weaves and textures, and they come in different colors, so you can color coordinate them for different tasks. The cons with microfiber cloth, there are two. First, it's a front-loaded expense. You've got to invest in your microfiber cloths if you want good quality ones that will last you a long time. And second, if you don't treat them the right way, you can ruin them. That means if you're laundering them incorrectly, we've got tons of information at the Makers Clean website explaining exactly how to do that as well as videos. So it's important to know all of this when you're making a decision as to whether you should use a microfiber cloth or a paper towel. Here are some of those common scenarios that we get asked about all the time. And I'm gonna tell you, paper towel or microfiber. Grease and oil is something we get asked about quite a bit here. Should I use microfiber or paper towel? Because people love their microfiber cloths and they don't want to ruin them. Now microfiber is a synthetic material. So much like if you get an oil stain on something that's polyester, you know it's quite a bit of work to get an oil stain out. Let's say you're frying up some bacon in a frying pan and there is some bacon grease that has splattered. Sure, you can use a bit of soapy water and clean it with your microfiber cloth. But if you're gonna be cleaning your pan and giving it a wipe down to get rid of all that bacon grease, no, you are using a paper towel for that job. The best thing you can do to get anything greasy, oily, or dirty out of a microfiber cloth when you're done using it is to give it a good rinse in hot soapy water, wring it out, and allow it to dry. When it comes to general stains and spills that you might encounter on a bathroom or a kitchen counter, Generally speaking, a microfiber cloth can handle them. Where I would avoid using microfiber is cleaning up anything that could potentially stain the cloth. A couple of examples, if you're in the kitchen and you're wiping up curry sauce, I know that turmeric stains, so I'm using paper towel for that. Same thing in the bathroom. I wouldn't use a microfiber cloth to clean up hair dye. Other than things that you know will stain your microfiber cloth, and frankly, that's just an aesthetic issue. The microfiber cloth can be used to clean the majority of surfaces in your home, whether it's a counter, a cupboard front, a wall, and more. One place that our waffle weave microfiber cloth really comes in handy is in the kitchen when it comes to food prep. So foods I would use the waffle weave towel for would be fruits and vegetables when I'm washing and drying the produce, as well as tofu. It is so great. I fold my tofu in a waffle weave and I put a big cast iron pan on it. Does a great job. You know where I wouldn't use a microfiber cloth? patting down meat, chicken, and seafood. What about using cleaning products with microfiber cloths or paper towel? What is safe to use where? If the product has bleach in it or if it's got anything waxy or oily, that's when I would use a paper towel for that particular cleaning task. If you're using a general cleaning product that doesn't contain any of that stuff, even if it's a DIY product that you've whipped up yourself, it's got some baking soda, some essential oils, absolutely go right ahead, you can use a microfiber cloth. So now you should have a better understanding of where to use microfiber and where to use paper towel. And I'd love to know in the comments down below if you have any other microfiber related questions, throw them down there and I will see what I can do to get you an answer. Now, taking great care of your microfiber cloths means that you are laundering them properly. And if you wanna know exactly how to do that, I've got the video right over here for you to check out. Don't forget to subscribe to the Makers Clean channel and you can visit our website, makersclean.com, to see our entire product range. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you soon.